try and find a hole and hopefully you can get out. <laughs> Up ahead, Simpson, here it comes for birdie. Oh, easy. Quick start for Webb. Talk about those overhanging trees, Nick. There's a good example there, the trees on the right. Yeah, you're right, Frank. It, the tenth hole, if you go too far right of centre, there's a huge tree that blocks it. Oh boy, that's. Uh, Meanwhile, if you go right at it, you have a short birdie. If you, we need, we need. He needs an earpiece. We that, need to talk to him as well. That lip, I think, blocks out the view from the fairway as we go to 11. Second shot for Webb Simpson. Beautiful angle into this left hole location. Wow, laying this hole to perfection as of right now. Perfect tee shot down the right. It's also a moment ago, Webb. Challenge the corner of the dog leg, hence just 105 yards. Even tries to draw his wedges. Ooh, good shot. Chance to tie the lead. You can hear Paul Desori, his longtime caddy, turn around and say this one was perfect. Colin, he only had about probably six inches of a bit of, of ground to, to get that ball to stay on to give him room between the, the TV tower and the palm tree at the back there. Good look here for Simpson. Good read. Mm -hmm. Wow. Yeah, Webb, the only one in this group to hit the green. Good look at it here. Dearly like to make this one. And he does. What a great putt. That's a great bounce back. With the wind coming off the left, now you're playing into it a little more, where from, we saw from Davis, he was kind of playing astride it. Wow. Thank you. You're going to see a follow through here as Webb really tries to get this ball working left to right. Yeah, beautiful here. <laughs> Money right there. How about good that? Reef, that was good. Good angle here for Webb. You'd like to leave it a little short and right of the flag stick. Kind of like that. Well done. It was the third that he had to play. <laughs> Very tidy. Mm. Wow. That was some he has just there. done that all day long. Not much traffic at that hour of the day either. Here comes Simpson from just inside 20 feet. And he's got the drop shot right back here at the eighth. Uh, talked about a lot of birdies here today, I'm sure. Wind now just starting to pick up a little bit. You're right. And that's an absolute ripper. Oh. Fantastic. Again, so Colin, that's Webb playing to his strengths, isn't it? Putting himself in a, a good spot and using his short irons to produce a great result. Now Webb's turn at the second. Just the grass grabbed that club so quickly, slowed the club face down, took distance off of it. A hole, or he could sort of take this a little heavier and run it back. How many yards do you think he got that, that shot to move, Colin? To be honest, I'd say that's somewhere around yeah. about 45 to 50 yards. Mm. And now Webb. Frank, a touch of breeze has come up to help the players. A touch from the right, that is a pitching wedge. Go. Oh, Stood tall on that one. So even though these greens are Bermuda. At the eighth. Eight iron for Webb. Backed off a couple of times waiting for the breeze to come up and it paid off. I agree, Daddy. He waited just for the right moment. Almost hold it. Nine is where we'll go. And yeah, Simpson. We're going to try and use the top bank. And it goes around the shoulder, gets a little closer. That's just a nine iron. Touch a breeze in. How is that breeze, Doddy? 
It's, a little stronger uh, or about stayed about the same? Or? No, it, it really hasn't done, done much. The biggest gust was back at 10 Paul Tesori saying trust it and trust it with a pitching wedge. Yeah, just trusting a little bit of right to left wind. Yeah, very good. Should be really good. That's the difference. That's the difference, Ian, isn't it? Soft greens. My goodness. Just typical Webb maneuvering the golf ball around the course. Got himself in a real good spot here. Nice angle. A little cutoff follow through. Should stop quickly. Right distance. Pushed it down there a little further with that three wood. Go. Oh, it is plenty high, Go. that is for sure, and starts just right of the flag. Wow. What a fabulous shot. <laughs> As I said, a uh, three-shotter, huh? Yeah, three-shotter. The way Webb is set up is what breeze there is seems to be maybe a little help off the left. See him trying to turn it into the flag, and this is the right distance. This could be good. Take it on. Posted that 62 here in the final round. Play well, gentlemen. Good start for Webb. And again, Fratelli's already posted 17. You have to take advantage of holes like this, part five, which is what Palmer and Simpson are going to do. I mean, these two play tactics probably as well as anybody out there. We tried to go in Thursday morning and they kicked us out. Nice. What a shot <laughs> by Webb Simpson. A tee shot for Webb sits up the second. Absolutely perfect tee shot. He walked past me in the fairway, Frank, and said, Whew, is it hot enough? This from 129, all carry. Watch out for that shelf just shy of the green. The flag, I should say. Well, we'll soon see if that second shot is close enough. Seven iron in hand. Stick him with his draw. Right there. Good, thank you. Oh, he hit that tree yesterday oh. too, Nick. No, he hit the other tree. He hit the left one and it kicked into the front bunk, and now he's at the right tree no. and got it inside with a birdie putt. Just a three wood here at the eighth tee for Webb Simpson. Ideally, you would like to keep it a little bit down the left center if you had your choice. Finds the short grass, ideal there at the very good par four. He had seven iron in hand, went back and grabbed eight iron, 185 all the way back to this whole location. Try and draw it in there, get it to skip forwards when it lands. That's his preferred shot and he delivered. Yeah, that's a lovely shot, right where he would have wanted it. 123, chance to strike here for Webb. And yeah, even lovely. Though even though it's from the rough, it's in the mayor's office, right up the throat of the green, Nick. I was just going to say, the only places don't hit it left or right, but a lot of break. Slider from his left, Frank down grain. Oh, oh hello. Oh, and bounce and just run straight in. Whip Simpson set to go. Nine iron, the club of choice, and it barely looks like that flag is on the wow. green. Yeah, you don't need to get hole high, just a little short, perfect. There you go. Especially the way he's putting. Just 140 carries everything, Frank, and he's playing back into the setting sun. Yeah. That's pitching wedge. Pretty good, Ben. Oh, so Once again, I mean, I'm just yeah. amazed at these. Yeah. To 17. Unbelievable leaderboard. This to go to 22. This is the one. Oh, wow. That might be the cushion. Oh, I think so. <laughs> two shots with those two holes. Wow. I would say it's been fruitful. Oh, go. 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 Pop yeah, popped it up. It up. It's going to land soft. Not a problem. 
back out. What a fantastic round.